Greetings and welcome to my channel. My name is Abagnatius and let's watch myself play Captain... No, uh, play Dyson Sphere program. <laughs> Sorry for that. Now that I have silicon in the system, it is time to turn that silicon into something usable. Mainly, uh, that means microchips. At this point, I was, I believe, uh, flying back to get some to get some stuff I would likely need. Um, I, of course, needed to um, have the ability to, or rather, I needed to to um, put the new microchips into uh, into the main line. Yep, there was a misclick there, and I and uh, as I knew that there was going to be an intermediate product, I made both levels. And let's speed this up a little. I'm just now connecting this. Uh, yes, and now I'm going to build the. No, I'm not. Okay. Ah, that was fuel, that was fuel tanking, and now I'm going to, um, I'm going to uh, remove that ocean to have room for factory. Okay. And now comes first, I believe, the um, the conveyor belt to bring. Nope. Uh, first, of course, the constructors, and then I'm soon, I hope, going to build the conveyor belts um, to enter the new product stuff into the back into the uh, into the main line. I mean, uh, four and three. These the top four are for. Um, the intermediate product, which is, I believe, this microcrystalline components. And the bottom three are going to make processors, which are going to be very important. And I believe in the future um, I will have to increase production on both. But silicon at this point in time is very limited. This is now the um, uh, the product line to bring. To bring the finished products into the main line. I promise you, again I haven't yawned once today. Uh, let's speed this up a little. Wonderful, and into that. Fantastic. Now I've got the exits. All I need is the exit uh, uh, sorters. Let's speed this up a little. Okay, then some power. Perfection. And now come the intakes. Uh, this first microcrystalline components require copper and silicon. And thanks to the power of the main line, as it currently is, I can just build this conveyor. Uh, hook it up and we have uh, copper in the whole thing. This is really cool. And there comes a copper. Now I need some silicon. And that we made just before or rather just in the last episode. Yes, I now was wondering how to bring that one down. Doesn't work that way, so I decided to make a U-turn. U-turn and go down with the U-turn. This is a little bit less elegant uh, than I would have preferred, but it works. 
Wonderful. Here. If my drones come back, here. This doesn't work, unfortunately. It's too close. But the center points, they work uh, perfectly well. So I decided to... Um, exactly. Just do it this way and this works. And here's the silicon. There is some work being done. I just press the D key. <laughs> and first... Here the first uh, 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 microcrystalline components are coming in. And are also already being... Uh, being uh, taken away for construction. Or the production of... Um, of processors. That's one of the... Uh, that's one of the resources. The other one... I just walked by it. I'm now looking for... Uh, no, I didn't. Oh, of course. That's the greens. Okay, here, knowing from the from the microcrystalline components uh, that this is going to be necessary to be built like that. Wonderful, let's speed this up a little because it's just finishing construction. Now the greens are coming in. And the first processor. And with that we have processor production. And the next episode is going to be very exciting. Uh, look forward to it. Until then, thank you for watching, like, subscribe, and not really if you so choose. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.